So for the next 24 hours, you can call us daddy. <laughs> what? <laughs> to clarify, for the next 24 hours, me, Matt, and Chris are about to become the fathers of little eggs. Little baby, little baby eggs. So delicate. Mm -hmm. They could crack. <laughs> Starting now, for the next 24 hours, me, Matt, and Chris are going to have to be parents to these little egg babies. They don't have, they don't have faces or identities yet, so we're going to spend the next Dude, few minutes. Stop. Stop. Wee! You know when people, like, the parents are like, oh, come on. Wee! Like that. They have no identities right now. They're just blank eggs, so we're going to customize our children. While we customize them and give them their little personalities, we're gonna go over a couple of ground rules. Ground rules of and requirements of what has to happen. We're going to have to wake up several times throughout the night to calm our baby down when they cry. No, I'm not waking up. Another ground rule, if your egg cracks, it dies. So yes. you cannot kill your kid in the next 24 hours or you lose the video. Everyone liked this video because Nick's gay. Another thing to note is there's no sabotage. So you can't go around trying to kill other brothers' babies. Your nieces and nephews, right? Yes. yes. I can feel his yolk. Ooh, Mr. Yolky, Yolky, Yolky. I wonder if you could pre-scramble eggs. Is that a thing? <laughs> My egg kind of looks like Jeremy Fragrance. No. No way. <laughs> Let me <laughs> <see>. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> That's the scariest thing I've ever seen in my He's life. He's kind of ugly. I kind of want to kill him and try again. No, you can't. That's your kid. I'd let it happen. If your kid was ugly, would you kill it and try again? <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Fuck him! Let's try again. Wait, so Nick lost. No, Chris, don't! That's just really, like, that, that one pissed me off. Why'd you throw Matt's egg? Cause I wasn't gonna like do another one. I won. <laughs> Nick. Oh. <laughs> oh. Look at Nick. Look at look at the yolk on my. Head. Oh, I didn't think it would explode like that. Okay. I just had to get revenge. <laughs> Nick. All right. So it looks like we're gonna try again. <laughs> Wait. Look at look at my. Get the camera. Get the camera. I can't. I'm coming. Matt, in. get the camera. Uh, <laughs> And it's like, dri look, it's dripping Ooh, off the table. I, if I, I can't stand up, it's gonna drip egg everywhere. <laughs> All right, we're back. Three new eggs. One, two, yeah, we've cleaned three. up the crime scene that was just in front of us. So we have three new eggs. So we're gonna create egg identity. I have to fully important. change outfits. And then after we create, yeah, and the, now you can hear the washing machine because the egg is being <laughs> washed off of their clothes. Okay, a couple more rules I'm gonna go over about Matt and Chris. I identify their eggs like real children you don't leave them alone because they could kill themselves by accident they could get killed they get kidnapped so you're not allowed to leave your egg completely alone for more than 10 minutes you have to have your egg in your hand on your bed next to you with you if you go out no matter where we go the only exception is we're gonna have crib safe zones in the middle of the night we're gonna create a little safe zone we just have to keep our kid happy, healthy, and alive. And that's it. Yay! All right, here's our eggs. This is my egg on the screen right here. This is Chris's egg. He has a red hat on. Yep. And this is Matt's egg. Yeah, I just saw you break it. <gasps> Did you see that? Is your egg, your egg's wet? What? He's like cracked a little. He's damaged. Ooh, you need to be careful. Let me see it, Matt, for the vlog. Show the vlog. I'm showing the vlog. Is this is un this is unfair because I have to drive. Give me your baby. I'll take good care. Hold him. Don't worry. Because me, Matt, and Chris are amazing parents, we are gonna go bring our kids outside for some adventure time. It's crazy. We're only going outside right to now bring our kids to bring out. out to bring eggs. They're not. To bring eggs they're out. They're not eggs. They're not eggs. They yeah, should maybe roll the egg all the way down the street. Nick, if you break. if you roll my egg, I'll kill you. You're chaperoning right now because I have the camera. I'm so happy that our eggs are going to be able to experience a nice little Mr. stroll Eddie on the beach. You want a bite of the Hersheywood almond? Nom, 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 nom. That's the scariest thing I've ever seen. What? 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 Look at that little kid statue. <gasps> oh my god. Yeah, that's that like in my Wait, I'm like really scared right now. Garage looks like a big flat screen TV. Record it. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> guys photoshopped something on that TV. Yeah. Sports, turning a little triplet video, RuPaul's Drag Race. Exactly. Yeah, I find it kind of scary. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, 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 yeah, how about we drop a slight 20 mil and buy one of these beach houses? No. We can't afford it. Tell me it doesn't look like I'm like an, a mermaid and I'm gonna just like run into the ocean and be with my mermaid friends. You know, so if you do, your egg out. will be in danger. Shut the fuck up. Mr. Egg on the beach. Can you stop acting? Like, this is weird. Like, I'm making jokes, but you're like being I have weird. so much confidence in the sand being soft that I would throw my egg on No, you wouldn't. I swear to God. No, you Let's wouldn't. Go. No, you wouldn't. Uh, I'm gonna risk dropping my egg on the sand. Of course, that's a risk. Are you serious? Yeah, I am. But it, your kid's gonna die. If I get out right now, but why? What's the reward? The reward is knowing that he has some life experience. You know, if I when I fell and got injuries as a kid, I grew up to learn from it. <gasps> there he is. Yes, how was it? Clean as a whistle. How was it? <gasps> how was it, Mr. Egg? We are He's the like, weirdest people. I ever. love it. I love the beach. Can you believe we're at the beach and we're just like carrying and holding? It? It's like if a cop saw us or something, they'd think we're like egging someone's house. Um, yeah, until they see these beautiful little illustrations on the egg. Let's go, let's go bring them on the, we should bring them on the swings. I already did, mine's Mr. Egg. Ow. Um, mine's Dorothy. Ew, bro. Dorothy the boy. Because Ugly ass name. I drew his face to look like a scarecrow, and I don't know what the scarecrow's name in The Wizard of Oz is. He's just the scarecrow, right? Correct. Life experience, like we talked about. We need to enrich Mine, that. Mine's life experience was almost cracking in the car. Yeah, that was a, crazy. That was his. Let's give him a shot. Give him a little push. A little push. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Toto, you'll be fine. Toto? Toto. <sighs> I thought it was dark. Give him a bigger push, Nick. Come on, Come on. life ex Matt, Matt, Matt. <gasps> wow. Give him a bigger push. Go. No, I'm nervous. He's, no, no, I don't know. is still in that, in the thing. <gasps> oh, he fell. Is he okay? He's not going to fall. He's completely He's fine. Fall. How fun was that? My egg is beating your guy's egg in life experience. I'd say if we were on a point system, I'd be at 10. Chris would be at like 7. Like, the throw was risky. And Matt, you'd be at like a 5 or 4. All right, I'm let's get least. out of here. And Wait, I'm the most now he's going to go for a, a trip. Ready? Over that? Nick, no way. Oh my god. He dropped him. Just he dropped him. Drop it's safe though, right? <gasps> safe. Wait. And he and I almost caught him. That was like a really dad and kid bonding moment. Go long. And he's safe. No, Matt. No. Go long. <laughs> Did it break? Nick, come here. Come here. Oh my. It did not break, but he is bruised. No. Like like a like and bruised. Bad. Like Matt. <gasps> Wait, let me see. <gasps> Oh he's not broken. You just need Wait. to be so careful. You need to be so Oh shit. Gentle. I'm gonna break your eggs and eat Don't, them for no, breakfast. No, uh, uh. I'm kidding. Absolutely... Alright guys, we'll see you with our eggs when we get back home. My god. What is that? Possum. Is that a possum? <gasps> Why did it almost bite my ankles? Where'd it go? Dude. Ah! Did you get him on camera? Um, I don't know. I, at the second you guys flinched, I whipped the camera on. Like. I don't know if I missed it or not. Holy oh, shit. I'm so hot. Dude, I left my egg at the beach. No, no you didn't. didn't. No, I didn't. It's in my pocket. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> oh. Rat. What? Rat, where, rat, where, rat, where, rat. Where? 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 Record it, Matt. Record it. Record it. Record no, he's it. gone. Another... Oh, no, he's not. No, he's not. <gasps> record it. Record it. Oh my god, no. It's, record it's it. not Nick, a rat. It's a baby it. possum. Oh my god. <laughs> Nick, Nick, Nick. Nick. <laughs> Nick. <laughs> oh my god. I just put my thumb in Matt's egg because the possum scared me. Actually? Like. <laughs> Almost. Did you see him climb the tree? I thought he's gonna jump in the car. I don't know if that's on camera, but that what? Well, you breaking the egg and scrolling up the windows on camera, but I don't know. Did you know. break the egg? He put he put his thumb like halfway in your egg. No, he's good. He's good. Is there like, a look. It's no no no. He's still not leaking. He's just bruised bad. Like he's like not. Oh anxious. my god, Matt! I thought that that possum. Was dead serious gonna jump in the car? Chris was like, record it. So I pulled my window down, I reached to grab the camera, I looked to the left, and it was in the tree! Yeah. <laughs> did you see it? Yes, I, I really hope it's on camera. It was staring at me! The like gelatinous. What? <laughs> the like gelatin kind of sensation that egg gives, I think is like pushing the embryo sac. Whoa! <laughs> because Matt's egg is like reforming. Like, tell me there wasn't a bigger dent in the car. I Let think like see. the the like the egg is like pushing back the shell. All right. So one of the challenges with your egg is you have to wake up and change his diaper at 
what time? Like 4.30 in the morning. In the <laughs> middle of the night. 4.30 to 4 in the morning. Whenever they know. cry, when we hear them crying. Like we're going to set an alarm and come down our room. Yeah. I don't know why we're torturing ourselves and stopping. No, it's part of parenthood. We're stopping a middle of the night. We're stopping sleep to come change their diaper at 4.30 in the morning. So we're going to leave our camera on a tripod right there. Our eggs are going to all be asleep in this very little box for the night. Good night, guys. Oh, no, he needs a corner. Okay. Eggs are going to be in here in the middle of the night. And then we're going to put the camera on the tripod right now, right here. And then at 4.30 in the morning, we're going to come down here. And the first person down here is going to hit record. And then we're going to have to cradle our egg back to sleep for 10 minutes before going Ten? to bed. 10? 10 minutes before going back to bed. I need to get my... Nick, I don't want to, like, wake up. Like, I don't want to be, like, so... I want to, like, con I want to like continue to keep my tired to, like, make sure I can go back okay. to sleep. We have to wake up and cradle egg for three minutes. Yes, there we that's go. okay. Much better. Someone set a timer, please. I don't have my phone. Someone have their phone? Does You're anyone have their phone? Set a timer for three minutes. Go to sleep, twinkle, twinkle, little star. I was dreaming of me and you. Chris, what? do you have to be weird, like the weirdest person alive, even? Me and Matt were on a pogo stick. How have you been sleeping? Good, bad, and haven't been able to fall asleep. You restart my fan noise on Nick, your you're, that's not a peaceful rock. It doesn't have to be peaceful. Good night. Now it is time to go eat food for the second time today. We ordered first time, so we stayed home with the eggs. So we're gonna bring the eggs for dinner because they're starving little kids. Tonight we're taking over. Little mess around. This place is about to blow. Uh, 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 oh, oh, oh. Okay, goodbye. Uh -oh. Thank you. Have a good one. Go, Mr. Egg. Yum. Can we talk about the world record egg for a second? So that was the lame. stupidest thing ever. Really overrated. Yep. Like, what are we doing? I want to be the world record, record like, bit post. Whoa, older. English. English language. Produced eggs normally take 72 hours before reaching your supermarket. That's a good amount of time. Wait. So we're talking fresh out the rooster. Like that's, kind of, uh, that's kind of insane. Nick, I like the hat you wore today. That's, was that on purpose? No. Bro's got the cock hat. It's honestly kind of insane to think of the fact that three days after being egged. What if, like, like how high are the odds of, like, like if, like... Nick. Like a chick. Mm -hmm. Like, what if you go to the grocery store and then you go to, like, the egg aisle and there's, like, 20 chicks running around? That's what I was going to say is, like, what is the difference between... There is no difference. We're eating baby chickens. Mm-mm. Yep. Okay, yeah, so they're just non-fertilized eggs. Thank if it, you! If an egg has been fertilized, the embryo begins to develop within it. It's worth noting that the eggs we typically consume are not fertilized. But what is the difference Can between... Can a store-bought egg become a chick? It's unlikely, but not impossible. <gasps> oh my god. So wait, well, how can you visually tell the difference in between a fertilized egg and an unfertilized Is there like a egg? tell, or do you just have to know that your chickens like haven't fucked? You know what I mean? Nick, you're taking it too far. I'm not asking the same questions you are, I'm just not afraid to use massive vocab. Mm -hmm. Wait, was Humpty Dumpty just a big egg? It takes 24 mm -hmm. Was he really? Mm -hmm. I thought it was just like a fragile boy. Mm -mm. Wait, is Humpty Dumpty an egg actually? Mm -hmm. Why did all along I thought Humpty Dumpty like had some ties to being an egg like in his name? No. But Humpty and Dumpty don't both mean egg. Mm -mm. In order to protect their children from the horrifying aspects of the story, parents made the main character an egg, not a human. I hate people make things easier for kids. It's like, no. Yeah, just tell the kid he's gonna fucking die if he falls off the wall. Correct. He goes up the hill, right? No, no, no that's Jack, Jack in jail. jail. <laughs> oh. Yeah. What's that? Smash or pass, Humpty Dumpty? Pass. Pass, majorly. That'd be a fun video. Smash or pass, like, fairy fables? tales. Fables? Like, We've yeah, done that. Like, that's insane. No, we haven't. Oh, not fables, but, like, 
You like the big bad wolf. wolf. You fucking him? No. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely. A chicken will lay bigger and stronger eggs if you change the lighting in a way to make her think a day is 28 hours long. That's kind of sad. Why are we yeah. manipulating them? Chickens can dream. Research has shown that chickens experience REM, rapid eye movement, while sleeping, meaning they can dream just like us. What if a chicken has sleep paralysis and his eyes open and he's like asleep and he can't move? And in his like sleep paralysis demon is just like a big chicken, like running at him, like a Nick, big what? monstrous chicken. What are like, you saying? Bro? Can you believe that? Like a chicken could potentially have nightmares, sleep paralysis. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Every pussy pop. How about this, guys? Like what? Chickens are very intelligent animals. Studies have shown that chickens are self-aware and can distinguish themselves from the others. They learn from one another, and they such as a chick learning from her mother which foods are good to eat. Chicken can also demonstrate complex problem-solving skills. Aww. So they do definitely think, like, in their head, like, oh, my God, there's a rope right here. I have to, like, get over this rope or, like, this fence. Like, I wish this fence wasn't here. Like, they're just thinking. Wait, is it vegan to eat egg? No. No, no eggs. You it can't? comes from chickens. No, Chris. Yeah, but that's, like, a healthy you way, You can't though. eat milk or cheese. But that's not, like, animal being chopped up. That's, like, just, like, it came from the animal. Still not That doesn't vegan. matter. That's you like can't even stupid. wear certain coats. Chris. Oh, I'm thinking of vegetarian, right? A vegetarian. vegetarian. I don't know. Is that a vegetarian with vengeance <laughs> to get you back? It's an angry vegetarian. <laughs> Nick, shut the fuck a up. A vegetarian. Nick. To finalize our baby's experience on this planet, we are going to put them to the drop test to see if they can survive hard life's hard impacts. Yes. Large trials really hard. tribulation. Okay, so <laughs> He's, He's good. Okay. He's okay. Let's see. He's okay. Yeah. <gasps> uh, -oh, uh, -oh, uh, -oh, uh oh. Uh oh. We heard a noise. Mr. A. It's good. No, it? it's not. Wow. A little crack. They're ready for the real world, Chris. All We're right, my turn, my turn. My turn. Oh, my gosh. Please, 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 wait, please. <gasps> no. <gasps> it's open. It's open. It's open. Wait, we have the first loss. <laughs> well, I'll say me and Chris won that challenge oh, and Matt oh, lost. Oh, oh. Is that it? Yeah, your egg is dead. Your egg is clear dead. Clear off the table. Why? Cuz. Let's all clear off the table and shut the camera off. Yeah. Let's just like. All right, everyone. It's been real. It's been fun. It's been real fun. It's been real fun. What are you doing? I can see it in your eyes. He was looking to My attack. egg broke, so technically I Broke? Lost. Motherfucker broke. Yeah, okay, There's I just have one question before we wrap up this video. Uh-huh. If we were to all crack our eggs, technically. You're scaring me. I gotta come with a hostage. No, listen, listen. Is it technically you lost of who's cracked first? Yes. I don't know. Please. I'm gonna need you guys to both focus up on this four minute video. What? What is going on? Hello Nick, hello Chris, and hello everybody watching this video. I know that you might be confused on why I am playing you this video in the middle of an egg dad video, but there is very good reason. And it's going to start with the second I knew we were filming this video, you look like a, play it. Like a, like like a villain. Play it. This is like they decided lost to crack files. The eggs during the first drawing attempt, I knew I was not going to play fair. I was going to win this challenge and I was going to be the best dad of my egg. And I was going to let them be the bad dads that they are. So, the second that they cracked the eggs, I went to the carton and I grabbed new eggs. But before that, I also made sure that there were two eggs that looked extremely similar to theirs. <laughs> what? Yeah! I put them at the bottom of the carton so I knew which two to grab when I went into my plan later in the day. Then, when we were taking the videos of the eggs to put on the screen when Nick told you whose egg was who, I calculated that I would be the one to record the eggs so that I had an exact image of what their eggs looked like at all times. Shut, shut, shut up! I am like up. so <laughs> Be quiet up. and watch. I am like be quiet and watch. Wait, wait a Go second. Back. Wait a second. I am like <laughs> I am 
Bam, boom. This is the most rogue Matt thing I've this ever seen. Why is it so The quiet. most effort he's ever put shh, into anything shh, in his shh. life. I calculated that I would be the one to record the eggs, but I had an exact image of what their eggs looked like at all times. The next thing I did was I am always the one to clean up the mess. So when I picked up the Sharpies and put them back <laughs> No, Wyatt, no. Wyatt. I made sure to take the three that I was going to need at the colors that they used. I brought them to my room and I put them in my box. Lucky me, I did not do this on purpose, but Chris got caught by a pretty easy distraction of his wallet being in the washing machine. Roll the clip. What? I have a fear that it's in my shorts. Your wallet is in your shorts. I have a fear that it is. No, I'll just leave it. Wow. Wow. Cooked. With this now new knowledge, I knew that Chris would be way too focused on his wallet and not on his egg. While me and Nick already had our eggs in our pocket, ready to go for the rest of the challenge, Chris was too busy seeing if the tracker in his wallet got ruined by the washing machine or not, so he was on his phone. With him being on his phone, it struck the perfect opportunity right? to bring in my newly drawn Quiet. 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 simply see that they were a carbon copy and switch them out and put the real egg in my pocket. Chris's egg was very easy to draw. I just had to make sure that the lines did not pass the red line of his head oh. and make sure that his eyes had no Watch it! <laughs> Watch! Shut up! Nick was a good egg dad. He sat there and held his egg while watching TV and doing everything that he was doing. I knew that he was going to be the problem and he was going to be my biggest competition. Not only was Nick a very attentive father to his egg, but he did a good drawing. But the only thing that he was missing was the fact that he was smudging it all day long, in the pocket, out of the pocket. So what did I do? I drew his egg perfectly, carbon copy. Then I went to my bathroom and grabbed a face cloth and I simulated the motion of taking the egg out of the pocket over and over and over again <laughs> until I realized that the smudges will match and mine is honestly a little more bold than his. Then, as we were eating dinner and cleaning the table, we decided to put all of our eggs on the same plate. Nick went upstairs before dinner and that was the perfect opportunity to go back into the room, compare the eggs, make sure they were close enough and take his and put it in my pocket and walk back to my room. Now the hard part was done. The false eggs were put out into the world and the real ones were in my possession. There were only two more things that I had to do. One of them, it was gruesome, it was evil, but your eggs were my breakfast. No way! After eating them, they were very delicious, but the hardest part after that was just making sure that you didn't fall for the trap and realize that your egg was a phony. And you guys were too caught up to even- Shut up! Most important part. And you guys were too caught up to even think about the fact that I was smart enough to do this. But thank you. You have lost this challenge. You have lost this challenge. Case in point. Don't fuck with me. <laughs> I is like am- I feel like I don't know who you are. <laughs> I was about to say, I don't think I could ever trust Matt the same. <laughs> that was insane! That was like that. You must be like living like a villain origin. Like, it's like, like it's like, like how do you guys thing. feel taking care of these? Here's phonies, the thing, huh? here's the thing. Here's I'm the thing. like, you did here's the so thing, here's good. the thing. I don't even care that he like swapped out the eggs. It's the fact that he goes, and what did I do? I ate their eggs for breakfast. No, that is the most mind-blowing The other day, thing. I go, Matt, are you hungry? He goes, no, I had two eggs for breakfast. Little do we know the I was full. I was foreshadowing time. the whole time. When we were at the beach, I said, I'm going to crack your eggs and eat them for breakfast. I told you guys what I was and doing. And you had already done it. Got done. That was actually, like, like, genuinely, that's the most... I thought the video was done four minutes ago. Nope. I'm in pure... Disbelief, and like I this, am actually this is a, literally the carbon copy of my egg. I am in mm -hmm. shock, and I genuinely think that this will alter my relationship with Matt for the rest of my life. This is the most shocking thing. I don't even. I can't even look him in the eyes. Like I like don't like a trust... fully edited video. Like when did you have that? Was... Don't trust Matt one bit. Oh my! It was God. difficult, but I got it done. 
That was unbelievable, Matt. I've been putting in overtime for the last two days. That was unbelievable. The wor- like the words he was using, the the expertism of like the slyness. I had this idea once you when you guys were talking about doing this video months ago, I had this idea of like on lock ready to go for so long. <laughs> I just can't believe that like in front of our own eyes he ate our eggs for breakfast, like actually. That's the least shocking part to me. I'm like I'm just shocked at who are these guys? Phonies. We have one egg left. I like can't believe this. Your eggs are, your eggs have been gone for Days. I, I saw you eat the eggs for breakfast. Like, I had no idea my own kid was being cannibalized in front of me. Mm -hmm. Fakes are right there the whole time. Wow. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this insane Friday video. The plot twist of Accenture genuinely, like, I am shocked to the core. Now, these guys mean nothing to you. These are just regular old eggs. Um, I hope you guys have a good day. Happy Friday, and we'll see you next week.